terms are so much different now than they were years ago. They've made a big comeback. To take us through the process, who's getting them, and how long it lasts is Michelle Rake here at Z Salon in Spa. They're very different than they were. They are. Yeah. They absolutely are. Because in the past, they were, what, really tight. Perms were very tight. And although we can still do those, and there is some desire for that Too, right yeah. now but but i think that's the image that we get when we talk about oh perms are back we think oh gosh why would anybody want to do that yes. but it's a very different look now yes if you have some natural wave they can give you a more consistent curl throughout they can also add volume they can make smooth styles where you do thermal styling stay and last longer for you nice so you'll just get those same results that you created that morning throughout the day. Is the process different than it was years ago? The process is very similar. The difference is the knowledge that we have and how we apply that process now. There are a couple of different types of perms that we're gonna look at. Tell us what we're seeing here. So one of the things that we're seeing with this long hair is she does have some natural wave, but where she's thermal styled it for years, it has destroyed the integrity of her natural curl. So we went with a spiral perm on her to give her a more consistent curl throughout and to bring that back for her. Another example, you mentioned young men coming in to get perms as well. We have an example of that. Yes, so with the younger men, what they're wanting to do is they're wanting to wear longer hair. But if their hair is so straight, it just hangs there and it lays and they just look unkept. So with the curl, they can keep the length, even grow it longer, and then keep it back off of the face and accent things that they like about themselves. And then last but not least, if you're looking for a little volume or lift in your hair, if it's fine, or for some of your older clients, they really prefer this. Yes, um, with this type of curl, what we've done here is we've created a lot of volume and fullness. And so what it has done is it has brought the attention up on her and shifted your eye, almost kind of like giving a facelift. Yeah. And so what is the main age group or target that you are hearing from that wants perms? There's actually two very different demographics right now. We're looking at gentlemen wanting perms, and I would say the age for that is between 14 and 25. Yeah. And then for women, we're looking at a demographic more like 30, 30 to 45. Mm -hmm. And then what is the maintenance like after you have a perm? The day-to-day -day maintenance is basically the same for straight hair. You do need to use products that are created for perms. Shampoo, so conditioner, things shampoo, like that. Shampoo, conditioner. That. Moisturizing is going to be your best friend. Um, you need gels that will provide the hold for the curl throughout the day, and that type of thing. And then how long does it last these days? Perms, typically what you're wanting is the maximum volume and fullness that you can get out of it. So with that in mind, it is a grow-up process. Yeah. So you're looking at about 10 to 12 weeks, 16 weeks. There are some longer versions like spiral perms, that type of thing. Those can last you upwards of nine months to a year, depending on the length and the amount of curl. And so if you're planning to get a perm, how much time should you allot for here at the salon? You're looking at, on average, about three hours. There you go. And you have that look. The perm is back. So different. That's correct. So it is. Get started booking your appointment. Go to zsalon.com.